Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Connor. Here with my father. Kevin. <laughs> you drinking too much? What? You missed the mark. You <laughs> opened your mouth before you spoke. I'll do it again. Let's do it again. Okay. I'm here with my father. Kevin. And today we are going to scare some hoes. Uh, <laughs> no, we are doing uh, the new album uh, by Danny Brown and JPEG Mafia. It is a collaboration album. Uh, it's been highly anticipated since it's been announced. Track number one, Lean Beef Patty. First off, fuck Elon Musk, ain't don't see much, this that's expensive. For the hoes in the back and the crack in the slack, my teeth is deleted, I meant it. I don't really need to check, cause I got no respect, and these niggas might know me like a dentist. You think what you want? No, you think what you want? Uh, fuck y'all niggas, I feel like Papa John. I can see this freaking out the hose. <laughs> Seriously. You're playing SZA before this? Yeah. The- <laughs> oh, that, now this is cook wicked. Okay, Danny Brown. Danny Brown. That was very cool. I like Danny Brown coming in there. When he, yeah, when he came in, it was really, really cool. Um, right off the top, I can say that that was not what I expected, but also <laughs> completely what I expected at oh, the same really? time. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, like I knew it was going to be something like that, but I didn't know it was going to be that. I don't know how to explain it, but it was like exactly what I wanted and, and what I was not expecting at the same time. I don't know how to explain it. Yeah. But you, you set me up with the whole thing earlier. It's like, I'm thinking like, okay, we're playing some Whitney Houston, all that kind of shit. And then somebody, it reminds me of when I used to go to the parties, we'd have just, just regular, like the foreigner on right yeah right and there was foreigner playing and then my buddy sean would come over with with someone from like pearl jam or, or nirvana like sub yeah. sub pop records and, and the whole place would, everybody would go this is not what yeah, we were stop that <laughs> five and two yeah depending on the crowd right track two step a pig Uncut with that top side my brain fried don't do drugs had two plus one test i'm up late no talk show thing pop up no way god can never this shit for me Oh, there's some nice shit going on here. Yeah, instrumentally. Yeah. I love that. Don't just roll to it. I like this one. Yeah. Give those arpeggio under the vocals. <laughs> this is really cool. I like this part yeah. here. They don't got nothing for me. It's like I've been working for crumbs. Now I'm feeling free as my speech. <laughs> this is really Fucking good. good. Yeah. <laughs> really good, man. Listen to this. He shots every day like DeRozan. You know what? I have to say, that was fucking so cool. Production. Production, but it was. It's it that was real art. Yeah, no, that was that was amazing. I am actually amazing. a little bit speechless. Uh, the whole time I was thinking, like I'm assuming JPEG did the production on this. Um, I was like, this guy is has a fucking knack at picking out the right sounds. You know what? And if, if, if you know those, yeah, <laughs> if those were fat, or, or they were higher, it would suck. They were right in that perfect right, they, tone. Everything was great. There, it was fuck. That really impressed me, man. I didn't yeah. know like. That was super cool. And for me, that was like really hearing, uh, I don't know JPEG's name. Is it JPEG? Just call him J- you call him JPEG. Yeah, JPEG. Yeah. JPEG for the first time. And, and he sounds great. Yeah. I love hearing Danny Brown though, man. Track three, Scaring the Hose. Scaring the hose. Play that shit out and touch the toes. Give a fuck about a trash. Cause I love the 
See, I love them. I love this already. You yeah. know why? I thought when Danny Brown came in, now it's that's great. <laughs> <laughs> I like love that, that game. <laughs> Give me my art score. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I fucking love Daddy Brown. <laughs> oh, that fat bass is great. Yeah. It just added to the yeah. end, eh? <laughs> Holy <laughs> that shit. That was pretty sick. That... Yeah, that would scare the hoes out of the house. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah sure. if we played that, right? Yeah. That, that was, no, that was great, though. You know, I have to say that I love the unconventional drops of where the beat's going to come in. I thought that soon as... Danny came in. Danny came in, it was really like... And it was like halfway through that. They're yeah. like... Oh, yeah, yeah, we have volume. Oh, yeah. Then, oh, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and they hit you with it, right? Track number four. Garbage Pale Kids. I'm going to say this again, like I said with Death Grips, is this experimental stuff hypnotizes me. Yeah. And I could sleep to it, and people will think I'm crazy, but, but there's works. something about it, man. Nice, heavy. Another cool track, production-wise. Not my favorite out of the bunch so far. No, but, no, not at all. No, but uh, guaranteed. But still, <laughs> why did you, just, did you not like it? It was okay, but it wasn't my favorite. Like, no, oh, you were just very. I was like, not my favorite. Like, yeah, not at all. Not at all. Not no. Guaranteed, hundred percent. Fucking bolt. Fucking sucked ass. It was shit. <laughs> no, fucking horrible. No. Thank God you said that. It was fucking <laughs> garbage. <laughs> Oh, no, I meant the other, earlier ones just gave me something else. Yeah, no, I still like it. I'm, yeah, yeah. Like, I'm not shitting on it. it yeah, yeah. Just out of the four we listened to so far, that was <laughs> you made me my least favorite. <laughs> well, you were just so happy when I said that. You're like, yeah, fucking yes. It's fucking shit. It sucks. <laughs> guaranteed. I should never say the guaranteed. Yeah. No, that was horrible. Yeah, no, it might uh, grow on you. I liked it. I just, it wasn't my favorite out of the four. Yeah. Track number five, Fentanyl Tester. <laughs> You know what I'm just saying, man. Uh, is it the car, the clothes, the money, the jewelry, the crib, the drug, or the hoes? Is it the cat, the meth, the weed, the lean, the molly, the boy, the blow? Uh, back it up. See that bitch, I'm acting up. Cause I'm right here with that up. Smack it up. Well, huh, ain't no whack it up. Put your center back, Oh, fuck. Stay, you ain't no accident. Mashing up, knocking on the road, the way we smack it up. That is like. It's fantastic, yeah. Yeah. Because, oh, see, I don't even know. They fucked me up, these guys. They know <laughs> it's a total different art, man. <laughs> you know Okay, that was pretty cool. That is pretty cool. <laughs> I, I like how Danny kind of took the spotlight for that track yeah, in terms yeah. of the vocals. Yeah. And uh, JPEG went fucking crazy on the production with that sample flip. I did, <laughs> not, did not expect <laughs> that <laughs> sample on Do you on know the, the sample? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't, yeah. You don't know uh, milk, My Milkshake Brings All the Boys to the Yard? Nope. You've never heard that song? No, should no we way. listen to what? Yeah, of course. Okay, let's hear it because I, I want to break it down because I've never heard... 
My milkshake brings the boys to the All yard. All the boys to the yard. All the boys? Yeah. Boys in the yard and they're like, it's better than yours. Damn right, it's better than yours. I could teach you. You know what I got? I, I, what I want to say off the tail end of that right there, Connor, is that I got to give kudos to... Danny Brown and JPEG Mafia. I think JPEG's doing all the the, the Probably production, most of the right? Pr production, yeah. Is that he is changing the sound, and I love this. He's changing the sound of what we should be expecting in our ears. We expect a full sound just like that. Yeah. Big fat covers the things, but the last track and the track before it, he was way deep in the background. It's had a, yeah. it had an AM type of feel. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. For sure. Right. And I think that's really cool because. Art is art. You paint a picture, you do it a certain way, and it, it, yeah. it, it could either be black and white or it could be depth or 3D or whatever, right? Yeah. But to make music and just not go, okay, I'm going to be sonically, like, fill the whole... The way that people typically expect, expect it to it. be. That's the art. I'm going to go outside of the box and, and make it sound totally different. Totally different. Like, that would wise. not be like a, a, a cranking in the bumper no. in the car. like. Not at in all. In the bumper? Did I say bumper? Yeah, bumper. <laughs> no, I meant like cranking it in the car, like super loud, because it wouldn't... You'd have it up, but you wouldn't. That's not one of these ones you like. Really, yeah, right. Didn't have the fat, heavy bottom end no, or anything. But I mean, that's the art in it. Is that they had the choice, the conscious choice to say, okay, we're going to make it huge and fat, or we're going to pull it down and we're going to trim off, you know, yeah, all the bottom end and make it in the in this midsection, right? Mm. And you got to give kudos for that. That's that's the cool thing about art. Track number six, perfect. Like what an interesting mix right here. I told me that nest, give me that fruit. Then the stops. Yeah. See this I think this stuff would be really, really interesting live. Yes. Felt like a wrestling match between the two of them, right? <laughs> you know what? Yeah, With this totally. music and the crowd. Yeah, total all-star wrestling. But you know what? They're they're wrestling with each other, but they're not really fighting. Yeah, like because they were they, they like each other, right? Yeah, so they're, they're like cuddling. <laughs> Danny Brown, JPEG Mafia, <laughs> yeah, cuddling. I really thought that was really really cool, man. I love the hard stops, and like I said, you, there's a lot of hip hop songs that will we could go right through in terms of having samples yeah. and having that sample element and they get boring live. But when you do the the Which? stop and the what? reversing yes. and the, the yes. DJ scratching and all that stuff. You could just hit play on fucking Pro Tools or whatever you're using, whatever DA or whatever, yeah. DAW, you can hit that and then it would go because it's so, it's got... Which is crazy for, to, for me to hear that from you because you're such a strong, passionate person about live instrumentation you're like oh, yeah. i wish more hip-hop artists did live stuff but this may be a drummer but yeah yeah, yeah even then i don't i don't think it needs you don't need much for a live show no like, I think it's because of you the know energy that they bring their energy and their stops and changes yeah like and i haven't been to any shows where we've it's just been a sample thing yet so no yeah right so we, we, we've been to jid and and what else we was uh, i didn't go to tyler um we went yeah, I know that you've only gorillas. Been uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gorillas and Jid are the concerts you've seen post COVID. I think track number seven, "Shut Your Bitch Ass Up" slash "Muddy Waters." <laughs> Did you get that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, 
that's cool. That was a nice beat yeah, switch. Yeah, what a switch. Is that called that's a beat switch, right? Yeah. I'm going to call it that then. Beat switch. This is a cool part. This is a great. Very cool. Very yeah, cool. That was cool. Having they both had their own track, basically. Yep. Like I look at that as two different songs. With uh, one was Danny, one was was JPEG. Uh, I, I usually I don't ask you to go back and read lines, uh, just because it takes time for you to scroll. Yeah, yeah. But I, I got to what? What exactly was the McDonald's line? Okay. Because <laughs> I caught it. But I don't think I fully caught it. On my mama, I was broke like a promise from a fat bitch saying no to more McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm sorry I had to laugh at that. Track number eight, Orange Juice Jones. I love all the scratching at the beginning. Yeah. She's attacked my side while I'm on my mind. That sample's nice, man. Yeah. That sample's really nice. <laughs> Was that real in here? Yeah. Oh shit! Fuck all these elements. Look at Carter. Look at this. Wait. <laughs> That was cool. <laughs> I was expecting a beat drop or something, like yeah, heavy yeah. to come in. Yeah. Uh, but the fact that they didn't decide to go that way made it so much better because I felt like that was how a lot of the tracks were going. I, that's so exactly, was, exactly. I was like, oh, this is great. There's, I know, no, I know. there's no fucking crazy yeah, drums yeah, yeah, or guitar yeah, yeah. that yeah. comes in. It just, Danny killed it over that sample. <laughs> I don't know how they rap over these beats. I don't know. I'm like, you guys are fucking mental. Um, I don't know how they're able to like they have must have some type of like inner type of oh, timer they're, they're, or metronome. They're, the, they're just fucking naturally talented to be yeah. able to do that. Track number nine, Kingdom Hearts Key. Oh, nice. Mm. I like this one. Wow. Yeah. Really like it. These guys trade off very well, too. Yeah. Very well. Fuck, I like this track. Yeah. It's, no, it's really, really, really sub cool instrumental. Yeah. Red Veil! Yeah. Red. No. <laughs> Fuck. That was really cool. Sonically, yeah. that was that was my favorite off this album. Yeah, that's probably top three for me in terms yeah, yeah, of, yeah. or so far in terms yeah. of just instrumental. Yeah, uh, starting with that acoustic guitar and having that that sample flow underneath was really really cool, man. Yeah, yeah. But those, like I said, those guys trade off very well. Like their voices are totally different. Okay, but they're able to seamlessly transition. Yeah, they they to work together. It's a, it's a really good musical vocal uh, vocal vocal. <laughs> <laughs> Vocal marriage. Yes. Track number 10. God loves you. Oh, 
Oh, I didn't think I'd hear this from God Loves You. <laughs> Make her squirt like holy water. Well, here, take a little bit for a while. <laughs> that was cool. You don't know that song, but that, no, was, no. that was a dope sample. Water that pussy like Baptist? Yeah, it's oh. a ski mask. Uh, oh. Okay. God loves you. I did not know I would hear these lyrics. <laughs> Those lines. Check. That pussy on my face. <laughs> I'm talking in tugs, Leg, legs in the air, scream hallelujah, make her squirt that holy water, <laughs> drinking on wine, but no communion. Only my dick she is consuming <laughs> on her knees saying, oh my God. I honestly thought when I when this opened up, it says God loves you, features an instrumental, right? You thought it'd be a more religious I of... thought it was going to be 100% <laughs> religious. They went there fucking... No, yeah, and, they, and they fucked me up. Maybe well, that's the way they... That could be their religion. Yeah, know? that's there's true. There's lots of different religions out there. Maybe that, yeah. that their God... There's the pussy God. Well, but that, that, you, you know what? <laughs> if there is a pussy God, I'm just going to say it's a little Wayne. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Track 11, Run the Jewels. I don't fucking Danny always gets me going, yeah. man. I just spit again. That was it? Yeah, it's a little short. Holy track. shit, that was short, short, short. As soon yeah. as I get into it. All the ones I get into. <laughs> yeah. They're I, super I, short. I'm assuming that's probably more of a like a transitional song to go for yeah. the next two. I mean it was it was dope, but uh, yeah. yeah, it's only a minute long. Track number twelve, Jack Harlow Combo Meal. Oh, that was cool. Yeah. I spoke to something unusual, but to me it's just regular haze. Girl, it's been minutes, it's been hours, and it's been days, bitch. I pray to you always. Fucking Peggy can sing too, eh? Yeah. Your bag is looking like shit. That ass is looking like shit. Almost 30 don't know who you is, bitch. Work it out. You ain't even on shit. Like the crow. Niggas want at you, I'm not at the act. Put you on the screen like I'm Christopher. You know what I have to say? That for me, uh, J, uh, Peggy, totally outshone. Outshined. Outshined. Or outshined? Outshone? Outshone. I don't think Out Sean. No, no. Outshined. Yeah, outshined. Outshined, yeah. Um, uh, Danny. Danny, yeah. Yeah, I, me too, yeah. I, when he came in and he sang, and then it was, it was super short. Then he went short. back to the rapping. Then he went back to the rapping, and then I was really, really stuck on him. Especially with like, that jazz sample beat. Oh, it worked with, yes, it, yeah. it worked with the jazz. It didn't work as well with Danny, but no, it worked it didn't. really good with, with JPEG. Yeah. You know what? It, man, man, we're always in each other's brains, man. It's crazy. <laughs> but the, the, I thought Danny Brown and the jazz thing just didn't work enough. Yeah. But then, and then Peggy came in and did his thing, and it just worked. It had the flow he was like yeah like this wow yeah, he knew how to how to work that yeah, yeah yeah no it was really really good man it was really good track 13 ho heaven on earth <laughs> Yeah, my bitch, she's so perfect and bad. And I love her, she's shaking that ass. Go ahead, girl, put that palm in the bag. Each on my leg, I know she wanna fuck this club up. Taking it down till she feel like it's us and we feel like it's slut. You know that they ain't no hard to me. Die for my bitch, you know that I'm calling. Uh, I'm not 
not a bad trap, I'm not a shot. Bitch with a cash at, I'm a computer. I feel like AP could just set a whole world. If I was them, I'd be pissed. They rock the graffiti and they get petty rent. I spit on your bitch and it shit, let me vent. She came back to you from a show, let him vent. I'm a star, bring it back, yeah. get it out. See, Danny fits with this one way yeah. better. Way better. Great voice, great sample. I don't... Okay, that was a that was an interesting one. Um, I said that about the last track too, but uh, the Sam. <clears throat> sorry, my you want a gold lost... Corona, sir? Yeah, <laughs> sorry, I lost my voice for a second. The sample at the end, I found really cool. I like what JPEG yeah. did uh, chopping that up, um, and then the yeah, the Danny fit a lot better on this track than he did with the Jack Carlo combo meal. Yeah, yeah, totally, totally. Um, I felt like he stood out more. You know, it's really cool to hear this because we haven't like I, I don't know what the first JPEG you're gonna throw at me. Like, uh, f- we'll probably do uh, probably do veteran. That's yeah. the first thing I listened to from yeah. when it came out. Track number fourteen. Where you get your coke from? Holy shit. Wow, crazy changes, yeah. man. Money made in a Harley, and we don't pick with all these cases in your copy. That bitch let anybody get she like the Harley. Oh, your bitch like. What is this? This is just Daddy's coming in now. Take some acid playing Jimmy or you experience. What's the fun clearance? I make my appearance. Show up incoherent. Niggas know I'm a degenerate because I'm so generous. Everybody asks me where you get your coke from. That, I tell you, was something I probably wouldn't play at a full, like, a party when I'm ready to... When there's girls there. When there's girls there, right? We can say hoes. Hoes, yeah. I don't like saying the word hoes, but <laughs> but I, I'll say it there. But you know what? I want to say something while we get catched on this one, uh, where you get your coke from. Uh, it was really, really cool. I love the changes, and I love the. I I think there's there's a part of me right now who's a lover of. You no, know, I love Nas. I love the I love the '90s stuff, right? I really like where we we came to in the with the Kendricks during like the you know 2000 like late middle 2000s and stuff yeah. like that. Um, I love the Jid, but there's a part of me that keeps pulling me to. The experimental stuff. Yeah. And you know that, right? Like the with Death Grips and I think and you, JPEG you like that industrial sound. I love stuff. the industrial sound. I love the thing about it. I could like it's just it's and don't get me wrong, I love everything else, but there's a part that pulls me to that where that's that's it's so different. But uh no, I, I had a fun time listening to this. I was uh not disappointed at all. Uh, a lot of people were hyping the record up, and I understand why. It's it's a very fun record. There's a lot of really interesting production, and I can see why they were saying that you would enjoy the production. Oh man, I, I I totally 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 dug it, man. And you know what? It's again, it falls in the MF Doom Mad Lib thing for me. I love mm. it, I'm, and I, I'm starting to love samples so much that in its art form by itself just samples, right? And I'm not sure if that was 100 percent samples the whole thing. I think a lot of it, there was a lot of samples. It wasn't 100% samples. Yeah, yeah. Like, I'm, I'm assuming the drums and Maybe, synth yeah, stuff yeah, were probably yeah. not. But but it, it was like, if I, like I said before, earlier in the, in, the, uh, in the thing today, is that um, <clears throat> it all starts to make sense, man, when people just put art down in, in whatever form it is. If it's putting, you know, what's a, where people put scrap paper together oh, to make uh, art? 
I don't know what it's called. Yeah, yeah, you're you're yeah, right. Over. And I saw a guy the other day on on YouTube, and he he writes somebody's name mm -hmm. like seven billion times to form the person. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, it's beautiful, man. It's like he in different colors and writes the person's names, like yeah, you know, and writes it all out, right? So, <clears throat> no matter what form it is, it, it it's uh when it, when you have to hear it or visual, you see it visually, man. It's it's beautiful, right? Yeah. Um. I hope you guys had a fun time listening to this. Uh, if this was your first time listening to the record, uh, I hope you had a good time. If, you, if you've heard the record before, let us know how you feel about it. Uh, I know it's been out for just over a week now, I think, so I'm sure you guys have had a lot of time to digest it. So what are you feeling? Has it grown on you, certain tracks that you liked? Uh, you know, Do you like them more? Do you like them less? Is there tracks that you didn't like that you like now? Let us know in the comments. Um, I would love to read those. And do you have anything you want to say to close off this video? I would just like to say enjoy spring. Things are coming up. Yes, spring is here. Yeah, and there's a lot of, uh, if you have allergies, I feel for you. Take care, guys. We'll see you soon. Take care. Peace. Bye-bye.